Hello everyone, this is going to be a general reading for the sign of Aries in the month of December. So let's see, what's going to happen to Aries? Aries in the month of December, please tell me about Aries. What's going to happen to Aries in the month of December? Okay, so you had these cards three cards that wanted to jump out. I'm going to keep them like this. Okay. Aries. Aries in December. Okay, Aries, so let's see. Um, you know what? I think you wanted to travel somewhere, but you're not going to um, anymore. Or if you do actually make this trip, uh, you're going to suffer some losses. Uh, there are going to be some difficulties uh, for you um, when it comes to this trip, because I see it here in your present and I also see it here in the future. Uh, for you, there are certainly going to be some sort of issues that are going to appear um, for you. Um, I, I guess this was a, a trip that should have been uh, made uh, at a long distance and uh, quite possibly abroad. I do see the Ace of Cups over there in the future for you, but you're very concerned. I think uh, uh, you're going to be concerned in the sense that... Mm, Possibly you are going to meet someone and you're going to be worried about um, am I actually going to be able to go because here in your thoughts, I see you discussing with someone, I see you being um, feeling very strongly that you want to, to do this. Um, the, the conversation and the collaboration between you and this person or group of people uh, is very good. It's just that there is this blockage that prevents you from going to to meet with these people. Um, I also see here a King of Pentacles. It's possible that because of him, um, you are not able to do this. Uh, he could be the one who either um, blocks this and you know changes his mind, says he doesn't want to go uh, anymore. Or you might even be concerned about taking this trip because of him in the sense that mm, maybe this person isn't going to feel well when we get there or, you know, so something along those lines. Um, and this person, I think, is someone who you were going to travel with or travel to see uh, because I see it in the past here that... Um, uh, you, you talked to a group of people, uh, you were going to, um, as I said, arrange things, uh, then possibly they sent you an invitation to go see them, um, but for whatever reason, things are not going to go well. Um, however, the, the outcome here in, in your distant future um, is very positive. I guess towards the end of the month, you are actually going to meet with someone from your past, old friends or maybe families. It's possible that this person has a child, the person who you're going to see. And it's going to be very nice and fun with that, uh, that person. So let's see. Let's draw some more cards. I want to see... What is it with this trip? Why is the Ten of Swords here? And why you are going to be concerned about this trip? And we'll also look at the outcome to see what's going to happen with this these friends that you're going to, to meet. So let's see. <clears throat> why is the Ten of Swords here when it comes to Aries uh, travels? Why, what is Aries going to have problems with? Why is the Ten of Swords here for Aries? Mm. 
yeah, you know, you're. it's possible that uh, you aren't going to feel that you know everything. Uh, it could be, you know, with all this curfew, coronavirus thing, it could be that um, you, you're, you're not going to, you know, feel that you have full control over the situation. You're going to be confused. Uh, it's possible that they make, may, uh, may make new regulations and you're going to be like, oh, I don't know. I don't know what to say. You're going to have this feeling of insecurity. Um, let's see. Why is the Nine of Swords in um, the near future for Aries? Why? What are they going to be concerned about? Yeah, you know, Aries. This is this. Uh, I think was going to be a trip made um, for you to see someone who you have a romantic interest in, and uh, you're concerned that you were not, you are, you would not be able to manifest this love that you have with this person uh, because of this um, <clears throat> impossibility to make this journey. <clears throat> Yeah, you were really looking forward to seeing this person, very help, uh, hopeful, but um, I, uh, I don't know, I'm not saying 100% that you're not going to make this journey, you know, but it's going to come with some hurdles, If you even if you do make it, there, there are going to be some worries there, so make sure you have everything in order, you know, your documents, your passport, uh, everything you need. So that things can go as smoothly as possible for you. Okay, so let's see in the future for Aries. Why is the Six of Cups in the future for Aries? Okay, is this some former work colleague? Why is the um, Page of uh, Wands in the future for Aries? Okay, and why is the Eight of Wands in the future for Aries? Yeah, you know, the future looks really, really nice. And you're going to meet someone, my, I, dare I say some former work colleague, or if it's not a work colleague, then it's somebody who... Besides the fact of meeting you, being with you, and so on, this person is still going to have to go to work. They're not going to have a holiday for the holidays, let's say. Um, but this person is doing very well in their life. And also I see you um, having, you know, everything you need. Um, after you manage to overcome this period of uncertainty and these worries about the, the, tra the travel, you will feel that everything has been set uh, in such a good way uh, that everything is in its place, so to say. And uh, you're you're going to meet these people. I do think that in the end you're going to take the, this uh, this trip, uh, Aries. Uh, you're going to have loads of communication with them. It's certainly going to be some get together with many people. Um, it does come with the three of swords. Maybe you're not going to be on the same page about everything, or maybe one of you is going to, to you know, mess up the party in the sense that spoil people's fun in a certain way. There could be some sort of, um, you know, not necessarily arguments, more like someone is going to have their feelings hurt. Somebody might be blunt or rude or something like that but uh, other than that Aries you've got the wheel of fortune the ten of wands the the ten of pentacles the eight of wands it, they, these are great cards you're go definitely going to have a very good end of the month and you're going to have loads of fun so um yeah make sure you have everything in order when it comes to taking this journey and afterwards i do i do think that things are going to be really really nice for you so that was it that was your reading i hope uh, you enjoyed it and it gave you some guidance and i'll see you in my next videos bye for now